A reading from 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 12 to 18. Now we ask you, brothers and sisters, to acknowledge those who work hard among you, who care for you in the Lord, and who abandon you. Hold them in the highest regard in love because of their work. Live in peace with each other. And we urge you, brothers and sisters, warn those who are idle and disruptive, encourage the disheartened, help the weak, be patient with everyone. Make sure that nobody pays back wrong for wrong, but always strive to do what is good for each other and for everyone else. Rejoice always, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances. For this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Amen. Meditation. Keep your life in the right perspective. Every one of us has something, even right now, to be happy about. Our education, our health, our jobs, our families, or an opportunity. Prayer. Father, you alone are my source of contentment. Thank you for blessing me with everything I need in this life. Fill me with your joy and satisfaction as I give thanks and praise to you. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. A reading from the Corinthians 2, chapter 5, verses 7 to 10. Therefore, we are always confident and know that it, as long as we are at home in the body, we are away from the Lord. For by we live by faith, not by sight. We are confident, I say, and would prefer to be away from the body and at home with the Lord. So we make it our goal to please him, whether we are at home in the body or away from it. For we must all appear before the judgment seat of Christ, for that each of us may receive what is due for our things done while in the body, whether good or bad. Meditation. We create much of our own unhappiness. We see what's wrong rather than what's right. We look at what we don't have rather than what we do have. We don't celebrate each day and appreciate the gift that God has given us. Prayer. Father, today I lift up my eyes to you. Show me your ways. Give me your higher perspective. Help me to take the limits off my life so I can walk with you in joy and victory each and every day. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 